Hello everybody, my name is Roxas Guy and welcome back to Outlast. I uh I believe this is actually going to be my last video for Outlast. So that's kind of exciting. We finally get to finish this uh insanity. All right. Okay. That's either ice or rock. Well, I mean, that's concrete, and that's kind of glistening, so I'm just going to go with I'm in like an ice cave type deal. Oh, that's nice. Actually, this... This actually looks like the area in the beginning of the game that the crazy psycho priest guy showed me with the SWAT team. Well, that's nice. Alright, a document. I'm actually going to go through and read some of the stuff for you guys that I missed. Some of the most more recent stuff. Alright, um. Under the mountain. Fuck, 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 fuck. Whoever finds my corpse, trust no one and tell everyone. I am not crazy. I know, I know. Only crazy people say that. But I am as sane as this world allows with a camera full of evidence. Don't call it a gospel. Call it a mockery of reason. Let the world know it is Murkoff's fault. Bury these bastards with my mutilated dead body. Alrighty then. Uh, from the personal records of Dr. Wernicke, Frankenstein, or the modern Prometheus, by Mary Shelley. Published anonymously in 1818, chapter 23, excerpt. Man, I cried, how ignorant art thou in thy pride of wisdom. Cease, you know not what it is you say. I broke from the house angry and disturbed, and retired to meditate on some other mode of action. Good to know we got some, uh, old quotes in there. That's always a good thing. Yeah, it's fairly dark in here. And bloody. And cold, I would assume. Oh, this is fantastic. Ooh. That's... That's gross. And I would have thought there would be like a document in here because it seems like a, uh, a laboratory, a laboratory, but whatever. Oh, even more blood splatter. That's awesome. Oh, there it is. Okay, that is a lot to read. If you guys wanted to read it, I think I went slow enough to where you could pause it and read it. Because, yeah, I ain't reading that. I want to try and finish this right here, right now. Maybe if I can get over there, I can go outside. Okay. Yeah, I go this way. See what else I can find. There's the morphogenic engine. 
This is the morphogenic engine. A few lines of mathematics, an algorithm, reprogram us, turn us into nightmare factories, a few numbers on a dry erase board, give me a hacksaw and a few hours alone with Dr. Warnicky's corpse, I feel I owe him a debt. Well, yeah, I mean, he... T technically, he's the one who took your fingers. Just strolling along. Oh, there's no going this way. Okay. Yep, never mind that shit. Uh, yeah, did I close you? Okay. Oh boy, oh god, uh, uh, okay. This is the way you die. Rip to pieces from the inside, watching your marrow splatter on a concrete wall. You've escaped one hell, Chris Walker. God help me, but I somehow hope you didn't find another. Jesus, he got fucking graded so I'm going to just assume that I can go this way I can just get the fuck out of here Or not. That's that's cool too. Can go that way. Hmm. Must 
Okay, and then... Morphogenic engine chambers. I guess I'm going this way. Well, this is quite the... Uh, ooh, cafeteria. I wonder if there's any food. Yeah, that's not my kind of food. Um... Maybe a good steak? That isn't, you know, human. I guess not. Actually, can I go in here? Oh my god, quit lagging! It never used to lag. Starting to piss me off. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Alright. Well, at least I don't have to worry about Chris Walker anymore. Okay, what just. Oh my god. Quit fucking lagging, Jesus Christ. Oh yeah, that's yummy. This way. Let's go this way. Any documents? Okay, fuck this. I am fixing this shit. Hmm. Uh, options, graphics. Everything is low. Alright, then let's put it very low. Except for textures. Effects and shadows can be very low because I couldn't care less. Uh, disable motion blur. Okay. Okay, that should have helped. Now. Okay. Why? Uh. Screw you, Billy. Screw you so freaking hard. Ooh, document. Whoops. Alright. No to all personnel from consultant double M double O eight. Rudolf Warnicke, do not worship the swarm nor allow the delusions of the patients to influence your beliefs. Any sentient being based in this technology will be so far superior to us that illusions of godliness will be reasonable. We have always looked into chaos and called it God. Now we are blessed with sufficient power that such belief could destroy us. Do not be tempted. Remember that you are scientists. Alright. Open big giant door. Alright. That's awesome. Alright, so I take it this is the main laboratory. Then there should, I mean, since they're all scientists, have been a, uh, another thing. Okay. I don't think that one made it. And you must be Billy. You look like you're having fun. 
Yeah. That's what it is. You're having fun. Ooh, battery. Oh, well. So much for going that way, I guess. Um. What are you doing over here, buddy? Hi. You okay? Alright, let's go in here. Okay. This is Billy Hope's lungs. His liver, his life support. A machine the size of a football stadium to keep one, to keep one lunatic alive. Fuck it all, break it all, he has to die. Seems like a good idea. If my computer would stop lagging. Like the dick it's being right now. I'm wondering if it's because there's so much going on. Do not turn the valve. Okay. Okay. Run. Must be up there. It's gotta be. Good lord, how high is this thing? Oh my god. Well, I guess we're not supposed to jump then, are we? Oh, hi, Billy! Okay. Alright. I think I'm safe for now. Please find attached the permission to proceed form for the patient William Hope of the Murkoff Charitable Psychiatric Program at Mount Massive Hospital in Colorado, USA. The form is standard and all relevant lines have been signed. It appears Billy is unaware of his mother's recent guilt-guided cardiac arrest. He is submitting to the experiment with the understanding unfounded of a financial remuner remuneration to his mother and a charitable contribution to her church. Warnicky, having read the boy's dream reports, believes he has an enor enormous therapeutic potential. Well then. Okay. 
Okay. Well, now it's time to run like a mad man. Jump. Okay. Hi. Hi, Billy. How you doing? You doing good? <laughs> That's that hurt, man. Jump. Okay, maybe not. It's all good. Hey, buddy. Ow. Okay, so I did get a new uh, document, which is fairly long, so I'm not going to read it. If you guys want to, you guys can pause it. And well, now I have a significant limp. Okay. Well, getting out of here is going to take uh, quite a while. Hopefully, I quit limping soon so I can, you know, like just run out of here. Either that or I'm going to be ripped from the inside out because I am apparently the new host. Which, if that's the case... Fuck. Uh, oh, no. Come on. Come on. Don't die on me. God damn it. Get the fuck up. Really? You are not drunk. You're just possessed. Oh, that. That's, that's good. Thanks for that. Oh. Oh. Jesus God, what is that thing? Mm-hmm. Well then. Okay. Um That was a really fun game, actually. I en really enjoyed it. The ending kind of... Mm, I don't see why I had to die. But, hey, Red Barrels, I applaud you. You guys did awesome. Hope you can hear that. That's me applauding you. But, um, yeah, 
I'm actually thinking about buying the new whistleblower DLC soon. So, hopefully I'll be able to play that soon. So, uh, hope to see you all in the next video. Hope you all enjoyed. And, uh, hope you like, share, and, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Later, guys.